This is my political cartoon. Uh, it, this is the James Comey testifying. Um, nine times he said he could be wrong, so I put that in my cartoon, you know, to get out of uh, perjury or something. And uh, it's him back in January. Uh, he's having dinner with Donald Trump. Uh, Donald Trump is saying, great salad, James Comey. I finished my plate. How is your fish? And he's holding up a plate, and there's carrot sticks that spell out Flynn, and a cucumber that spells out I, and then some pineapple, an orange, some berries, and some peppers that spells Flynn, I hope. And uh, James Comey is saying, I could be wrong, but are those vegetables talking to me? I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Because that's what he said during his testimony. Um, so those who didn't see it won't get the joke. But um, he's going, how's your fish? Donald Trump's going, how's your fish? And James Comey is eating a fish pie. And it looks really gross. And he's got a little book on the table. It says, Dear Diary, January 2017, you know, to refer to his memo. And Donald Trump's eating steak and ketchup. A little T-bone steak, T for Trump. And because uh, that's what he eats. And Mark Dice made a joke on InfoWars. He said something like, you know, did, did there have to be carrot sticks spelled out on the plate? And he said it on InfoWars. And he also said it on his uh, YouTube account. And that's where I got the joke about, you know, the carrot sticks on the plate. Um, the vegetables that, that spell out, you know, I hope Flynn gets to stay on, you know. I just want to add that after I posted this, um, Twitter blocked my account, suspended me for three days. So, <laughs> I mean, I wasn't doing anything out of the ordinary. I didn't break any rules, didn't, didn't comment hardly at all. Um, I was just posting and then it just shut me down right then and there and said, you know, sorry, um, we've detected suspicious activity on your account and it's not suspicious because I do the same thing every day and I'm really sad because all my tweets to Donald Trump are on Twitter and I feel like it's part of history, you know, all the cartoons I've done for him. Thank you.